All right, how's it going, everybody? It's your boy Bruce N here, and today I got a quick little tutorial right now on how to play the Fighter Z beta early. Now, as you guys know, there's been a bunch of network problems going on with the Fighter Z beta on PlayStation 4 and Xbox One, but here in this video, I'm going to show you the surefire way to get past all the network issues. Nothing bad is going to happen. You guys are just you going you get you're going to skip everybody in the you're going to be at the back of the line, and then you're going to jump to the front of the line because you watch this video and you're gonna, you're going to have the strat. You're going to have the new strat on how to play Fighter Z open beta early. So what you're gonna do is you wanna get, you're gonna wanna turn on your PS4, you're gonna navigate to the, the Fighter Z open beta. Make sure you have that bitch installed. If you don't, then this is pointless, or you're gonna have to come back later and watch it. And uh, you launch it, you try and play the game, and uh, there you go, right there. So then what you're going to want to do is you're going to close application, then you're going to head over to the Dissidia open beta. That works. There's no network issues there. And then you're going to play that bad boy for a few hours. Now, I know this is a, <laughs> an actual fix for the Fighter Z beta. As you can see recently there on Twitter and everything, people have been just slamming Bandai Namco about the Fighter Z beta. It's actually amazing that some people are even able to stream this. The closed beta uh, the other day, or the pre-order beta was having a bit of issues before and people were just like spazzing out on Twitter about it. They were cursing out Bandai Namco and I felt kind of bad for the PR guy because he's normally like, you know, he normally handles that stuff well, but like you could see like the three ellipses after just like, oh, we're working to fix this problem. Like I felt really bad for him. But um, yeah, everybody's like, they're not really feeling this beta and it, it kind of sucks. It's like, I don't know, like, everybody's complaining about the network issues, and they're like, oh, we're probably just not even gonna fucking bother buying this shit, and it's just like, I don't, like, it's, I, part of me wants to say, what did you expect? The servers are gonna be super shit, because this is a game that everybody and their mom's really hyped for, but it's like, at the same time, I'm looking at Bandai Namco, like, I feel like you guys should have prepared for this, but that's the excuse that everybody tells, like, every company, it's just like, oh, why are the servers so shit day one? Why don't the companies fucking expect this? Like, they do expect it, it's just that I feel like personally they don't have like the power to accommodate to all of those people all at once, like... The servers day one for just about everything are almost always garbage, and it's just like... Right now you're just gonna be surrounded for like, I guess the first few hours of this beta with the fail to initialize network issue, and that, that sucks! I know it sucks for me personally because I wanted to play this for a while now, and it's uh... It, it's like it just doesn't work and it's kind of it's it's disheartening to see that so I'm gonna have to pretty much wait and rely on gameplay on some youtubers or whatever watch my friend streams for, to pretty much I guess sort of enjoy the game my favorite part of the Dragon Ball Fighter Z beta is waking up at 5 a.m. to play it and dealing with a shitty lobby system then wait 40 minutes to get a fucking match only to have my opponent lose connection while loading this is fucking miserably terrible yeah these guys are these guys are very salty. These, these guys are... Oh, everybody's just calling it like a failure and shit like this. It's like, why are you like... Oh, man. I feel bad, but at the same time, like, I don't. Like, I don't know. That's just me right now. I'll, uh... I'm gonna... I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna leave it at that. I'll see you guys later. Peace.